Just because that one felt like pretty quick. Two led by World Chalice. Wow. So this is a regional? Yeah, this is a regional. So we got Salad versus Centurion. They're going to activate Circle. It goes through. Um. Okay, they definitely have this player's score messed up. Because they have not marked as 5-1-1, but it's round 6. So they're going to go... Spinny in the Bailing, Bailing Search Sanctuary, Summon out Spinny, link those two off, and then make Cyber's Wicked, sure, Gazelle Effect, Special Summon out, Cyber's Wicked plus Gazelle, so they can go ahead and search, and then go dump, yeah, they're gonna read over Cyber's Wicked, so I can search a couple, well, that, ah, I guess I can search, uh, what's it called, I, I, I can't remember the names, I don't remember the name. Okay, they're gonna Ash. I don't remember which chain, I don't know which chain link was which. It looks like they're just searching Weasel. It looked like a salad name. Sure, 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 sure. They only have, they don't have enough salads in Graveyard yet, so they can make Bailings and then link off Bailings plus Cyber's Wicked to get two salads in Grave. Make like Princess, Princess Effect a special summon back out. So that's fine. Okay, bring out Gazelle. And then they're gonna go Gazelle plus Princess and the Raging Phoenix. It's so crazy how like other decks do this, but this is like Salad's actual combo. Raging Phoenix and the Raging Phoenix. Go ahead, search. Grab out Solomon Great Roar. So we didn't weasel. Huh. Did not weasel. We're just gonna go set three pass. Mm hmm. Do we have a floodgate maybe? I know the floodgates got hit down, which is tough. Isn't Jack Jaguar a better normal summon than Spinny if you start like that? Uh no, no, because you'd have to commit your Sanctuary to relinking Bailings instead of relinking Raging Phoenix. Because they didn't want to use their Gazelle early because they wanted to get Cyber's Wicked to go search. They didn't want to go through. Yeah, 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 it'd be tough. It'd be rough. So they're going to go ahead Ash Pot of Prosperity. That's fine. I mean, you could probably do, like, a very, very, very similar combo with Jack Jaguar, but I feel like then you're starting to play into more things. Summon out the Primera, Primera effect. Oh, they had Crossout, so... Uh, they didn't use Crossout last turn. Okay. I guess it's fine to not use Crossout, but... It's interesting to leave it in hand. I mean, to set it instead of leaving it in hand, because then you don't beat Rock. But yeah, reads the stand-up centuri on there. Okay. So activate stand-up effect. Discard Ash Blossom. Go spell on trap zone. Uh bring out Trudia. Yeah, they're gonna have to read that. Yeah, they're gonna read all of them. Trudia special summon. Make it level eight. Effect spell on trap zone itself. Bring out from the deck. I guess there's Bring out the Primera, or Primera, for next turn. Okay, they're gonna Princess on that summon, and then they just submit the feat. Yep, just hoping that the opponent misplayed. I don't even know if I would have committed into showing my opponent my deck, though. Yeah, I don't think I would have even showed my opponent the deck there. It feels like you just lose no matter what. Okay, going on to the next game now. We'll go ahead. We'll see Centurion go first. Now, Salad can play a lot of hand traps. A lot of hand traps. So, we're going to see those end up getting dropped here. But does Centurion open a hand that can play through him or not? The Salmon Grade player also had to read the opponent's cards. Maybe they don't know how to hand trap them properly. Um, there's like different ways that you can use hand traps against Centurion. There's actually like three effective ways to use Imperm. There's three effective ways to use Imperm. You can use it on the Primera on their first summon. You could use it on 
the Synchro 12 to stop them from getting the draw one and spawn trap zone one during end phase. Or you could hold Imperm for your turn to try to hit the Crimson Dragon. But they're gonna go ahead, Oath, go for Primera, Primera, Special Summon itself out, Effect, go Search. And then, yeah, you gotta get access to stand up, so unless they already have it, they're gonna grab it. Yup. Grabs the stand up there. And then, activate, discard, spell trap zone, just basic combo. It's one thing I like about Sun Turn on, it's like, it's turn ones are like extremely, extremely, extremely easy. Normal summon out Trudia, Trudia effect. I don't know, decks like that where the turn one is easy is nice. Shinna, Embla, Set? Uh, I mean, they probably should have gone for Set there since they had Trudia in hand. Because they could have just tried to combo with Trudia and see if that had worked out. But, I don't know. I guess they decided to not do that. Activate Pot of Prosperity, go Banish 6. Look at the top six. Okay. Do we hit a judgment? Come on, judgment. Aw, oh, we can't see him. Boo! I saw a trap card. But boo! Not being able to see the prosperity is so tough. So a primary, I guess, hit. They still have access to field spell at least. Yeah. Well, they didn't have... Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I get what you mean. Yeah, yeah. Like Trudia in the primer. If that gets hit with like Ash, then they can still combo. Yeah, I don't know why they played it the way that they did. It doesn't make sense to start with that. Not one bit. Not one bit. So now, well. I guess it could. What if you get hit with Imperm on Primer, right? Hmm. I guess, like, Imperm on Primera, you're, like, a little bit better of a situation there. But not even, like, that much better. Then you could have been in a different spot. Now, you'd still be fine in a different spot, yeah. Because they Imperm, you still have set stand-up, stand-up in the Emeth, into the 12, in the Spell Trap Zone, and the still FC Kane. Okay, so... Oh, gosh. Set three, end phase, spell trap zone, pass turn. That's tough. So, yeah, Sal, Sal drew zero hand traps, by the way. Sal drawing zero hand traps is like impossible. They're gonna go normal summon out Lady Debug. Lady Debug effect, they're gonna go chain the special. They could have Cosmic. Cosmic also just stops those. It's a very popular card in side decks right now. So then they chain to Imperm to shut down the Lady Debug. Yeah, playing Centurion right now just sounds crazy. <laughs> everyone's on tons of hand traps, and everyone's side decks into Cosmic Cyclone and Bistials. Yeah, and Bistials hurt that deck too. So they're gonna go one, two. Okay, they try to Emeth, but they bell it, which doesn't actually mean anything. Because they can still just go ahead and make the Crimson Dragon. So it just stops a tiny bit of follow-up. So they're, they're still gonna search. Yup. Couldn't see what they grabbed there. But then Crimson Dragon effect here. Yeah, just go ahead. Bring out Calamity. Calamity, they scoop. Yup. <laughs> Alright, simple as that. Simple as that. FTKs are FTKs. Oh, I want all FTKs out of the game. Holy... I hate them so much. I, I prefer interactive game states than those kind of game states. But on to game number three now. We got Sal going first. So Centurion does play a lot of hand traps. And also, you know, there's, there's one that's very good against the deck. It's called Rock. Droll's also really good against Salad too. Uh, okay, so they make Bane Links. They don't use the effect to search Sanctuary because they already have it in hand. They go Spinny Effect, get hit with Bell Pass. Wow. Wow. The deck is pretty fun outside Calamity. You can play it with Horus and or Bistials and still have 15 on engine. Yeah, I agree. I agree. I think I think the deck is going to be cool when that card gets banned. It'll probably get banned on this ban list. The same way OCG did it. 
and then they get the new Synchro 12, which is infinitely better than the one that we already have. So Primera effect chains in Permana. Okay. Do they have what it takes to play through? Uh, yep. Activate Stand Up. It's a very, very, very good card there. Discard Trudia. I see Cross Out in the hand. Okay, so they took out Bell from their deck when they went first, but had it in going second. Now, Trudia special. And then obviously make a level 8 effect. Spell Trap Zone it. Bring out Emeth. Never mind. Okay. So they're going to go summon, effect, draw, pop. That's fine. Then. Here's the thing. What do they have exactly? I'm guessing that they have MS in hand. Yeah, I'm guessing they have MS in hand. Uh, Centurion too expensive for a fun deck. It's like 150 euros in EU. I have no idea how much this stuff costs. Probably not that much, right? Actually, I, I have TCG player pulled up. Let, let me, let me actually peep real quick. Center, Eon, I guess I gotta put the space thing, the dash, okay, Centurion, let's go hide a little, skip past all the CRs, uh, a lot of it looks really cheap, oh, I guess, okay, Trudia, Okay, Trudia Primer are like 15, 20 bucks each. Sure, 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 sure. I guess that adds up pretty quick. Okay, they're just gonna make. Oh, jeez, I looked away for two seconds, but they went. Oh, they had Bell in their hand. So they went normal summon Bell, will bring out Spinny, Mirage Stalia, activate Imperm Chain Cross Out, call it Imperm Chain Cross Out, call Cross Out? I'm sick. And I, I know Salad Player is sick too. I know they're sick for sure. But the opponent had another interruption too anyways. It didn't even matter. Because we know they have to have Emmeth in hand with how they've played. So they still have like Primera summon itself out. Search. Emmeth target Synchro 12. Spell Trap Zone at Special Summon out. Make Synchro 12 off Stand Up. Draw Pop. So like they, they still have like an interruption here anyways. They're gonna go spinny effect, chain bell. I'm actually kind of surprised they didn't just pop the Mirage Delio. Or wait, why didn't they bell the will? Huh. Okay. But it's just game. Yep. Special effect goes search. They have special. Um. They could just search Trudia there. Special, increase the level, make Synchro 12, draw 1, pop Mirage, Dahlia, normal summon out Trudia, 35, 35, 1k, 8k altogether. Oh, they're only, wait, they took damage last turn anyways, I was gonna say, they're only at 45 right now. They didn't do that last turn? Uh, I guess they still had it set up there anyways though. I guess I, I guess I don't get why they didn't do that during Salad's turn, because they could have gone Primer, summon itself out, effect search Emeth, Emeth target Synchro 12 anyhow, even if they didn't already have it in hand. Oh yeah, they do have Bailing Engraver to try to protect, but that's fine. That's fine, yeah. Battle phase beat over for game. Yep, and they knew the last card in hand was Sanctuary because they didn't Bailing search. Yeah, GG, GG.